All right, guys, welcome back. We are going to resume here. Don't you guys think this is a little bit... Oh, come on. She deserves it. Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? It was just a prank, Han. No! Shut <laughs> First off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals So this is just a recap of chapter one. I'll actually be a little interested to see if they keep doing this once I have a bunch of different choices available. Share some moments that we'll never forget for, for the sake of my sisters. I need to go find Sam. Son of a bitch. And even this part, I don't know. And next to Josh, that's how we met. Like, Ooh. if the girl kept lying, maybe what he didn't look through the um, binoculars there. So we're back to the characters right away. We're going to see if this changes. Okay, it didn't, but when I... But between the last video and this, I just happened to click on this. And as you can see, if you look at the characters, Ashley... Uh, Jess and Sam especially there's the white line there that's kind of where he started with them and then it's the blue parts actually like where he is now reputation wise or relationship wise I should say I don't think any of his other characteristics went up but uh, he improved with Ashley and Jess obviously because he shot the squirrel there Sam was pretty pissed so that's why it dropped quite a bit, or at least I'm assuming that's what it is. Okay, so that was pretty interesting. So the save system here is such that basically Ashley was looking pretty hot today, right? Sorry. Like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? Now I just want to rip that parka right off of her and make some snow angels, right? Hey, cut it out, man. Yeah, I mean, if you're not going to bang her, maybe Michael take up the case. Wait, will you back off on Relax. Already? Just checking to see if there's some blood flowing down there. Yeah. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. Yeah, I'm going to agree with him there. You're a hunter, bro. No fear, no mercy. I mean, she won't even know what hit her. <laughs> Smooth things right, over right. with Josh. That's pretty funny to begin with. So, how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. You better deliver, Koshis, or else you got four lovely ladies who are going to be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh, shoot. Nobody likes cool buns. Clue found axe holder. Should contain an axe, but the axe is missing. That's fantastic. Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. I'm okay. 
Should have paid more attention in climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. Whoa. Did I do that? I, I don't think so. Here, use this. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. What, what is it? OK, so I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant going to help? Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I got gotcha. you. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the little army dudes. Yep, ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye-bye, frozen lock. Bingo. All right, so you got this. I'm gonna go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim. I love his attitude straight up. Not really, but I mean, sure, why not? So here we've got a totem pole. That looked like somebody got lost, lit on fire. And Chris is holding the lighter right now. So what have we here? Ex janitor convicted for arson. Okay, I'm not liking where this is going. Seems like there's a lot of fire going around. Actually, that reminds me too, that really creepy guy that was chasing the, well, the really hot twin and the kind of weird twin. He had some weird flamethrower thing going on. I guess I'm supposed to walk this way because the camera won't go any other way. Well, let's check this out. Huh? That's cool. Hannah's wearing a distinctive locket. Okay. So, I realize that this is a horror game, and... What the hell was that? Sorry, what I was going to say is I realize that this is a horror game, but I'm kind of hoping we at least get to chill for a couple seconds inside. Very funny. Oh, how'd you know it was me? Shouldn't you be like getting the lock open or something? On it. You know, the L1 button really doesn't speed you up much. It's kind of lame. Okay, I definitely heard that one. I have no idea where this bathroom is. I guess I should have actually looked at that clue, but oh well. Seriously, why isn't the owner of the place down here looking for this stuff? I 
I guess it wouldn't be that scary. And it wouldn't explain why I have no idea where I'm going still. It kind of looks like there's supposed to be a button over there. That's okay. How hard is it to find a bathroom in this place? Okay, well judging from the camera angles, it doesn't look like it's down here. Well, I must be going the right way because I did hear a noise earlier. Oh, probably up the stairs. It's a good thing Chris doesn't have to piss because Creepishly open window. This must be a bathroom, right? The one with the door already open? No. Oh, here we go. Haha, -ha, bathroom, I have found you. Okay, well played game. Perfect. We're freezing our buns off out here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll, I'll be here all week. <laughs> 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 Crap, that thing freaked me out. What was it? Are you okay? It was like a bear or a tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby Wolverine. Baby? Don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. <gasps> okay, so half the crew's here. Oh, there's another one. Home sweet home. Sweet is not the word I'd use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire going. This place barely looks any different. And yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? N not a lot of action up here lately. Nope. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Make yourself at home, bro. We'll do. Yeah. Come on in. Take a load off. Have whatever you want. You just take whatever you want anyway. Right? Whoa. Easy there, cowboy. What the hell were you doing with M out on the trail? What? I saw you and M. With the telescope. Before? We just ran into each other. It's been a while, so we hugged and I said hello. Is that against the law? I'm apologizing to try to right. smooth things over here. Yeah. Duh. Sorry, it's been kind of a long day. I overreacted. Nah, man. Don't worry about it. Be cool? Yeah, yeah, totally. Oh my god, that is so gross. <laughs> Are you trying to swallow his face whole? Um, I mean, seriously, can she be any more obvious? No one wants in on your territory, honey. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness too loud? Sounds like someone's bitter she didn't make the cut. Yeah, it's all a big cattle call with that dream boat. Congrats, you're top cow. Cuts real deep calling Miss Homecoming a cow. Ah, uh, let's defuse the situation. Yeah, come on. No, shut up, Matt. Oh. Stay out of it, you dirty 
dumb oaf. Hey, watch it. Oh, you're the only one who can put him down? No one else can play with your toys? You're such a bitch. Whatever. I don't give a crap what you think. At least I can think. 4.0, bitch. On a roll. Suck on that when you're trying to sleep your way into a job. Who needs grades when you've got all the natural advantages you can handle? Oh, please. You couldn't buy a moldy loaf of bread with your skanky ass. <laughs> Are you serious? Do you think that's insulting? That bitch is on crack or something. Okay, let's provoke. Jessica, you need to shut your mouth, okay? No. You're the one who needs to keep your nose out of other people's business. I'm about to get right up in your business, you bitch. Are we about to get real? Because I am down to get real. Stop it! This is not why we came up here. This is not helping. It's not what I wanted. If we can't get along for ten minutes, and maybe we need a little bit of a break, right? Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, all right. You want to go do that? Any place without that whore. It's right up the trail. <sighs> Glad that's over. Yeah. So, Josh, uh, should we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the, the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you, are you listening? Oh my god, don't you remember next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. Oh my god, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Well, do I... Do you? Guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. And then we can get warm? We can get very warm. Okay. Okay, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. Okay, so that was interesting. Ah, <sighs> exiled. Sexiled. <laughs> Works for me. Oh, far. How far is this cabin, anyway? This cabin is the coziest, most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes upon. <laughs> if we ever make it. I have a feeling luck's on our side. Play your cards right and maybe you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars! Gonna need these. Porn star? I'd pay to see you. Uh, gross. Hey, I'm sorry to kick you out like that. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. <sighs> oh, I almost forgot. Gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right. Roger that. I think Josh was flirting with me. Okay. You want to invite him up with us? Wait, really? What? No. <laughs> They're doing a pretty good job with the script here so far. It's nice to hear a uh, dialogue that actually sounds like a bunch of teenagers would make. Why is she stopped? Hey, Hot Lips. Photo booth? All right, read my mind. <sighs> okay. Oh my god. <laughs> this is perfect. We're like the cutest couple. Damn. You should be a model. You keep that camera handy, and maybe I'll let you start my portfolio at the cabin. Wink. Noted. <sighs> Burr, it is freezing out here. Now that's something I can help you with. And how are you going to do that? Uh, I got a few things in mind.
Emily's as dumb as she looks if she thinks she can cut in on what we got going on. Maybe if we're lucky, she'll try and follow us out here and get eaten by a bear. I think you bring out the worst in her. Is that so? Epic jealousy. Suck it. Let's check out this one. Ooh. A danger totem. So I don't know if that was her that was just getting punched in the face or if that was somebody else. All right. Let's see. Boom. Nice one, Mikey. Zam! The gates shall open. Pretty good, right? Yeah, totally. That was just awesome. Oh, yeah. I bring the hit. <laughs> you psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. I am so psyched right now. <laughs> it's like a little adventure. Oops. Sexcapade. Wow. Police tape. From Hannah and Beth. I think they'd clean it up. Well. They never close the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. Well, wherever they are, I'm sure they're happy we're all thinking about them. That's a nice way of thinking about it. Yeah, just keep smoothing things over. You gotta get to the cabin and go and get some. I don't think we can get up to the cabin with the path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, a.k.a. Wax Museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily. You know what? Fuck it. We're adventurous. We will find another way around. Ah! Ah! Jess! Fuck! Hey, Jessica! And... Hey! I'm okay! Holy crap, you scared the heck out of me. I was just gonna say... Your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> uh, yeah. Can you get out? I... Uh, I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. I'll be heroic. All right, coming after you. Just stay put. <laughs> hey, handsome. Want to help me move this cart thing? All right. Help me move it, help me move it. I imagine just grunting together. This is 
is not what I pictured. <laughs> <sighs> I'm not liking the fact that he is not seeing the creepy guy following him. Let's get adventurous. Let's go and, uh, why the hell are there mines here in the first place? Ah! Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, holy ah. crap. Oh my gosh, are you okay? Uh, yep. Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. So did creepy guy get ahead of us, or? Nelly, this place is giving me the willies, and not the good kind of willies. Can I offer you a little comfort and reassurance? We'll save it for the cabin, Buster. I feel like this is not going to be a good totem pole for us. That was a fortune totem pole. Well, I guess she was waking up alive, so there's that. Uh... walk the other way. So I'm pretty sure I'm going to be missing some stuff because it looks like there's actually quite a few collectibles and I probably won't find them all my first playthrough. This is like historical. Holy bat cave. It's gotta be Native American, right? I don't think the miners were getting their arts and crafts on now. <laughs> you alright? Yeah. Close one. I don't think this place is up to code. Yeah, I'm thinking it's time to go. Fixer rubber. Wonder where that extreme rockfall danger is. Probably right where we're headed. Knowing our luck. actually made it out. I definitely thought that guy was ambushing us in there. Hey look, a sign that says cabin. Sweet. This is actually quite a walk oh, to a guest wow. cabin. When Josh said cabin, I felt like Abe Lincoln. <laughs> Where do you see the Lincoln bedroom? Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? Uh, I'm take a ride on Air Force One. <laughs> all right, all right. Save it for the stump speech, buddy. Oh, a telescope. Gonna look at the trees, gonna look at the clouds, gonna look at the cabin. Uh, whoa. You all right? I just saw someone at the cabin. Okay. <laughs> Let me 
say. I didn't see anything. I still don't see anything. <sighs> Sampling the old eggnog again, babe? It's just us up here. Uh, maybe. Hey, Jess? Mm hmm. Stay close by, okay? What's up? Uh. This posting says there's some brown bears up here sometimes. Oh, Michael, I have the best idea. What? Let's go hug a bear. Come on, please. Come on. Let's not hug a bear. <laughs> I don't know if I missed it the first time or why the telescope thingy cut out the first time, but I definitely didn't see anything. Watch out, bird brain. Rat wings. Oh, poor Mikey. Did the little birdie get your panties all bunched up? She's so gross. Like diseases and shit. See, now I was focused on the deer that was over there. So at what point does it become less of a guest cabin and more of just like a second general cabin? Josh, and you have at least cleared out the path before sending us up here? <laughs> really? What? I didn't figure you for the glass half-empty type. You got a better idea? Stand back, Debbie Downer. <laughs> oh, boo! Show off. Hey, Mike. You've got something on your face. That's how it's gonna be. Yes? <coughs> yes! Sammy! What? You wanna help me get this fire going? Uh, well, I was just getting into the bath. Oh. Oh, do you need any help with that? Hardy R. Come on. All right, Josh, let's see if you know how to hook up the hot water in your big fancy lodge. I'm kind of upset that they ended that where they were, or where it was. What was that? Somebody should seriously invest in some lights.
about Mike. So I'm kind of curious, uh, it doesn't even give me an objective, or no, I have to hit the R1 for the objective, I think. Oh, fine, Josh. Okay, so you guys can see all my stat changes as you change to the, between characters. So she got a little more, or a little less honest, a little more curious, and Chris and Jess are down. Which one's Jess? Oh, Jess is the one that just got kidnapped. Never mind. joke man they don't do shit no way bro i mean we used to do it all the time me and well hey josh no hot water's kind of major oversight don't you think yeah yeah you just gotta fire up the boiler it's in the basement all right you guys see if you can find the spirit board chris let's go find it it'll be like a scavenger hunt um okay guess so brad i mean you're not gonna regret it you up for a ride along? So we've got two determined couples. One couple that wants to be together, Chris and Ashley. I think her name was Ashley. And then these two who are just kind of the wild cards because I'm pretty sure Sam's not interested in Josh. And I've already been down here once. Notice how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together? Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. And I just wish Chris would go for it. He's so paralyzed, thinking she's gonna shoot him down. It's not gonna happen. Which thing? Well, neither, if he doesn't go for it, which knowing Chris, he won't unless someone's holding a gun to his head. <laughs> Josh. I just wanted to say. Uh, what? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year and you know that you came, Sam. Josh, we're here for you. Really, whatever you need, whenever, we're all gonna make it through this together. Um, I want us to have a good time, you know? Hey, watch your step. I think I can handle a little old set of stairs. Mm -hmm. Sorry to drag you down into the bowels. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know? Well, it's definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. doing here? 
Is that yours? You bet it's mine. I used to play ball with my dad all the time. Of course, that was before he got too busy to hang out with me. Ah, we'll save it for the couch, right? Okay, let me see what I can do with this old hot water machine. Okay, so I'm pretty sure that's one of those if you find a weapon in earlier chapters you can use it later on. Here, can you can you hold this? What was that? What was what? Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing. Okay, there's no way this creepy guy just took Jess and is able to Hey. Can you just keep the light so I can see, okay? I didn't think I moved. Sam, please. Okay, I'm just gonna put the controller down. I don't know, maybe... Be really rough later on. I had to put that on a flat surface. Before we get the boiler fired up. Mm, it sounds kind of complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. Ah, oh, damn. It's okay. I'm just try again. Definitely thought I just saw somebody on the right there. Yeah. Almost missed that uh, little quick time event. That could be a lot of things. None of them nice. What it? <laughs> I'm just, just joshing you. <laughs> oh, you were really freaked out. or some problem with the furnace. Unlikely. Okay, so there's like a creepy pony thing in the background. They just passed, yeah, and it, right. uh... I don't know, it kind of creeped me out. Ah! Whoa! Not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you... are you serious? 
Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor. Joke master. Well, I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared, admit it. I was not. Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh. What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're going to take a vow of silence. Okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Oh, 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 oh. Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. You know what? You know what? No, no. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Mm. All right? So have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, Josh. to understand your feelings toward people who fear the supernatural, ghosts, spirits, and other intangible forces beyond the veil. Do you share this fear? Yeah. Is that so? Because that's not reflected in the way you are playing your game. Now is it? investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. Which would you say was most important in a person, loyalty or honesty? I think we're gonna go with honesty here. So, you would tell the truth, even if it resulted in an unpleasant outcome, a friend. And what about honesty then? And charity? <laughs> charity is overrated, I suppose. Better to be true to yourself than to help others in need, eh? And now he makes me sound like a dick. Again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. So with a little luck, this will be the end of the chapter, and I can start a new video for the next one. Okay. You know what? If I'm seeing this previously on, I'm just going to end the video here, guys, and I'll see you in part it was three. just a prank, Han. This is just a recap, so I'll start the video as soon as I get control of the characters. Today is the one-year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy of Hannah and...